Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited. This is my first video of the new year and it is going to be a good one. I'm manifesting that right now because it's already my second time trying to film this. So um, I'm doing something a little different. I don't think I've ever done this on my channel. Honestly, don't mind my lash, you guys. I have to point it out because I'm going to be staring at it the entire time and I hope you guys aren't. But I just don't have time to go and try to fix it so we're just gonna go with the flow here but I am really excited because I've never done a fashion haul on my channel I don't think I mean not that I have thousands of videos on my channel or anything but I've never done a fashion haul and that's something that I'm really I've really worked on over the last couple of years is trying to come up with like a style trying to figure out what I like what speaks to me you know when I see something I'm like oh that's so me you know and kind of dressing to a point where if other people see something like it reminds them of me and not because I need to people to be Reminded of me, but I just feel like there's certain people, you know, like when you when like I have a friend Nora for example So if I see something at the store that I know she would love and know that she, know that she would wear It's like that's her style, you know, like I get that I it's giving me her vibes And I feel like I don't really have that I dress so different all the time like I can be very Sporty and I can be very casual like just leggings and a t-shirt or a hoodie or whatever um, I can be super dressed up and like pink or red or yellow like have all these colors when I wear dresses I feel like that's when I wear colors a lot of the time um, But what I like to wear and what I would love to find more of like in my closet are neutrals whites I mean, I have a lot of those things, but I feel like I always tend to lean towards like black or like a deeper color um so i'm really trying to like warm it up with like whites creams neutrals like olive tones things like that so anyways i'm learning and i'm trying to find pieces that are really you know good quality but also versatile like things that i can wear with other things that i might already have or they can be easily like matched or paired with you know anything so that's I don't really know why I needed to explain my style journey to you guys, but there it is. So I went to, um, actually went to Lululemon the other day. I guess I can share that in here too. I went to Lululemon because I got a gift card for Christmas. I've never been to Lululemon before. I did get a pair of leggings for Christmas and then my brother ended up getting me a gift card as well. So I was like, okay, I like these leggings so let me just go get some more. So I got this color and they're so cute. I also got some shorts, but I wore them today. so. They're in the dirty laundry, but look at these leggings. This color is so pretty. So these are like my tones, you know, like the earth tones. I like the sages, the greens, the browns, that. So anyways, I went to go get these because I needed to use my gift card. And um, then I'm like, oh, let me just, let me just go look at Zara. Let me just go check. Let me just go see what's happening over there. And then, of course, I haven't been to Zara in a while. And, of course, the day that I walk in, there's a sale going on. So that's where we are. And I got all this stuff in here. It's a really big bag, but it's honestly not that many things. I think I got, like, four or five items. But I'm really excited about them. So we're going to get straight into it. Okay, so the first thing I got is black, <laughs> but this is the only black thing that I got. So um, I got this, so it's just this place, it's this basic black bodysuit. Um, it goes down, the sleeves are about like three quarters, not even three quarters, it's like halfway. It's not all the way down here. It's like, is that three quarters? I don't know, whatever. Um, clearly I've never done this before, but it has like, um, we'll just call it a three quarter sleeve. And then this neckline looks a little intimidating, like it looks like it's gonna go super, super low, but it actually cuts off at a really nice point. Um, it's a ribbed material, it's like kind of stretchy. I love this material that they carry at Zara. This tank top I'm wearing right now is actually from Zara as well. It's a little big on me, so I pull the straps to the side, but it's just a regular tank top with a little two strings. Um, I think this is a size medium large, so it's a little bit big on me. That's why I wear the strap this way, but um, this is actually the same material as this. This does feel like slightly thicker. Um, what is this called? I think this is a part of a collection, but I can't remember what it's called. Like all of this stuff that has this material, it's not, mm, maybe like the contour, like body contour or 
seamless contour or something like that um, anyways this is super super flattering on I got this in a size extra small small because it, it goes extra small small and then medium large I didn't see a small medium anywhere because that will probably be my like perfect size but I went a little smaller on this just because this material um, stretches a lot and when it is tight and it does fit you the right way it really shapes your body super nice I have another one of these tank tops this is a medium large I have another one that is white and it's an extra small small and I feel like the way that that fits me is much more flattering to my body so um, that's why I got that um, that's why I got the extra small small in this because I knew it was like similar material um, but yeah just a regular bodysuit it's not like a thong or anything it's just a normal bodysuit but it really sucks you in and like shapes you really nicely so I loved this and this was I believe $13 like $12.99 or something like that um, because it was part of the sale so this is like super if I can um, get the you know lighting and the courage to do a try on haul then this might be a try on and I might show you exactly what's what's up or I might just place pictures of the items um, so you can see them a little bit better because I know this is a little difficult to see but this is my first fashion haul so we're figuring it out if I can get a couple clips of myself like trying the different items on I will so that was the first piece um, the next piece I got is so cute Normally I wouldn't buy anything like this, but I just recently went to um, Fresno, which is my hometown, that's where I'm from, and I love the way that my sister dresses and like the things that she buys, and so she was showing me some clothes that she just got online, and I was like, oh, like I see she's she buys like a lot of cardigans or like flannels or just like things that can go over tank tops or be worn on their own or whatever and so I was like I need to do more of that I need to get more cardigans that can be worn as shirts or just like over things and tucked in or buttoned or unbuttoned or whatever so I got this kind of like cropped cardigan it's a really pretty cream color and it is such a nice material it's not super thin like it's definitely nice quality I think it'll last a while um, I got a size large because they only had I think large and extra large so I got a large just because it's a cardigan so I feel like it can be you know messed with it can be tucked in you can um, button it you can do like the whole just the middle button thing which is really cute and sexy and sultry wear like a lace bralette under this I don't know but I thought this is really cute I like when the sleeves are a little extra long and they kind of hang off of your hand a little bit so I guess this I can just try on for you guys right here, but if I can style it with an outfit, I definitely will. Um, so yeah, it's it's not like too big or anything. It's um, It cuts off at a nice place. Like it's not super cropped. I could wear it with jeans and it would be totally appropriate. Like if I, you know, worked in an office or something or was gonna wear it out to dinner with like some black jeans or like a black skirt or something. It's very very cute and this was also like $12.90 all right next I have in the same like color scheme um, a sweater this is kind of this is not really like a hoodie like it's not a pullover or anything but I just thought it was like a really nice elevated zip up sweater because usually these zip up sweaters like soup they look super slouchy and like you know I guess bummy like they don't really look like you can really dress them up I mean sometimes you can if you just have that kind of like fashion ability but I don't so I like that there were a little bit um, there were details on this that were a little bit different than what you would find in like a normal zip up um, sweater so I felt like the zipper is actually like pretty thick and um, it has like the little circle zipper oh my gosh little um, circle zip, zipper thing and then the sleeves are a little different like they don't they're like a wing sleeve they're not like totally separate from the arm so I don't really know how that's gonna look on but the material of this is what sold me like it's very nice it's not like a sweater material it's not a hoodie material it's not like that it's almost like a almost feels like a canvas I don't know but it's super cute I feel like it would go with a lot of different things I could see myself wearing this with jeans with leggings with um, a skirt I could see wearing this over a dress like it's just a really nice color and a nice material so I really 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 love this um, and I'm really excited to wear this I guess I could try this on right now too let's just see what it looks like so the sleeves are like you know they're like wing sleeves they're not 
the regular arm sleeves. And then this cinch the bottom like cinches in a little bit here. So you can wear it like a little higher up, you can bring it down lower of your leggings. It does have like pockets. I don't know. I just think it's really cute. And I could see myself wearing this like as like an everyday piece. This was $25.99. So this is a long sleeved ribbed cotton bodysuit with has like kind of like that extra long sleeve as well. Um, it has like a crew neckline, so nothing super special there. And then it has this detail here, which obviously like I haven't tried this on yet. So I'm interested to see where this detail actually lays on my like boob area. Cause I feel like it's not going to be like right underneath my boobs, which is a little weird to me. Like I don't know exactly where this is gonna sit but i think if anything it'll be like right above my belly button and that could be still really flattering the the reason why i bought this bodysuit is because it kind of it's a little sexy like it can be dressed up you can obviously wear this with super high-waisted jeans and it would be fine it wouldn't look crazy or anything but this is like an extra long bodysuit and it's not it's not um like a huge size it's a medium so the fact that it has this like extra long piece here tells me that where this actually hits is gonna be like where my jeans actually hit on this my jeans are probably gonna hit about here on this piece and you know my hips are gonna be sticking out a little bit I that's my theory that's why I bought this I you can't try anything on in the stores right now so when I looked at this that's how I imagined it um, fitting me was like yeah see so fitting kind of like a crop and then your jeans fall like right here so you have kind of like your hips out i just thought this would be really cute for like you know dressed up like date night if restaurants ever open up again or anything or if you know we ever are allowed outside again and can dress cute or even just take pictures i don't know i thought this was really cute though so this was $13, $12.99. So I thought that was Zara basic, but not like super basic. That makes sense. I don't know. And then this was super out of my comfort zone. This is the last thing I got at Zara. Um, this was very out of my comfort zone, not because of the color or like the style even necessarily. It's just a, it's just a little different than anything I've ever really worn before. Like I don't really wear button up shirts or anything. Oh, actually it's 100% cotton. Well, I don't know, but it just feels very thick, you know, like it has a lot of structure to it. Um, and then it has like, not an actual collar, but kind of has these like, like tuxedo shirt, like detail right here. Um, like it almost has lapels, you know, and then it's long sleeved. It has a cuffed sleeve, which I love because I feel like that just makes it so much more professional put together looking and then it has all these pleats at the bottom which kind of create like a almost corset effect and then it has all these buttons like so many buttons I didn't think about this honestly it's hard to see but it has so many buttons on the bottom of this shirt so but all the buttons are going to be concealed when it's actually on because this part doesn't let the holes come through so Let's just see what this is gonna look like in theory. Obviously I could wear this open if I wanted to, like if I just had like a little lace bralette under and like um, some jeans, that could be really cute. But I think the way that it goes, I probably wouldn't wear much of a bra or maybe like a, still a lace bralette or like a sticky bra or something. And then I'd have to like spend an eternity buttoning the whole thing. And I think that could be really, really cute with um, obviously like a nice light wash of denim, um, light washed denim jeans, or even like a black leather skirt this would be really cute with. I don't know, I feel like there's a lot of ways to wear this and I'm gonna work on that, you know? I'm going to try and expand my horizons because I am not that great at putting outfits together just as far as like my history goes, you know? But trying new things, I'm really trying to look more put together in 2021 and not like I'm going anywhere but just in case you know and even if it's just to have the pieces in my closet for just to have the pieces in my closet if they ever decide to open the wall back up and we can go outside again and we can do things and we can you know have places to go to dress up I have clothes 
Um, and this one is $16 and I got it in a size medium. I'm so glad I got a medium because a small definitely wouldn't fit. A large would have been way too big. Um, so it's like the perfect size. I think it's going to fit really nicely and I'm excited to try and find something to wear with it. So that's it for Zara. Um, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys, oh my God, my eyelash, like did I really film this entire video with my lash like this? Wow. I should have just fixed it, but I didn't. Oh well. Ah, that's what I get. Okay, well, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and definitely check out some of the stuff from Zara. Zara, the sale should still be going on, so definitely check online. I honestly recommend that you just go online. You can probably find what you're looking for a lot faster that way. I was just browsing through there for like at least an hour, um, but I think shopping on the website can be a little bit easier if you shop by size and shop by style of whatever you're looking for um, in that sale area you should have a pretty easy time. So I'm going to stay away from it because I do not need to spend any more money. Don't need to do that, but I hope you do and I hope you enjoy it. And um, more than anything, I hope you are staying safe and healthy and still remembering to take care of yourself, still remembering to dress up if you feel a little down or something and you want to get ready and you want to put on makeup and you want to put on a cute outfit. Whatever you have to do, just make sure that you're taking care of you. And I hope to see you soon. Bye.